Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to schedule a function in your algorithm. So at this point, we've seen that your algorithm spends uh, most of its time in the handle data function. And this gets run every minute. But let's say you wanted to do something like run part of your algorithm once per week, or once every day at a specific time of day. That's where we use schedule function. So let's take an example where every day, half an hour before the market closes, we take a look at the 10 minute mean close price of SPY. In front of me, I already have a reference to SPY and a function that actually prints this mean out. And what I'm gonna do is add schedule function to initialize. And I'm gonna use schedule function to determine when my check mean function gets run. So first I'm actually gonna pass check mean to schedule function to signify that it's the function I'm scheduling. And whichever function is being scheduled needs to take context and data as arguments, which we actually do down here with check mean. And then I'm going to specify in terms of days how frequently this function is going to run. So I'm just going to go date rules dot, and then from the drop down, I'm going to select every day, which actually means every trading day. And then finally, I'm going to put time rules. So that's what time of day uh, we're scheduling this function for. And I get another drop down menu, and I'm going to go ahead and pick market close. So here I can put minutes equals 30 to specify that I want this function to be run 30 minutes before the market closes. If we were instead using market open, the 30 minute offset would actually be after the market open. But here it's 30 minutes before the close. And now before I test this, to show that this is actually running half an hour before the close, I'm going to add a print get date time statement in our check mean. And I'm just going to pass uh, US Eastern here so that we see the the timestamp in Eastern time. And this should show us 3.30 PM. OK, so in the logs, we see our function is getting called every day, half an hour before market close at 3.30. All right, let's take one more example, where let's say I want to open a position in SPY at the beginning of the week and close it at the end of the week. I'm going to get rid of check mean, and I'm going to define open positions to uh, order a target percent in SPY up to 10% of my portfolio. And then I'm going to define close positions to close out my position in SPY. And now in initialize, I'm going to schedule open positions to run at week start market open. And I'm going to schedule close positions to run at weekend, half an hour before the close. I'm leaving a bit of a buffer before the actual market close, because sometimes orders can take a few minutes to fill. This won't be the case with SPY, but it's important to be aware of. And I'll just add a couple print statements to our function so that we can see when we're opening and closing our position. And there you go. Aside from anything that needs to be run every minute in handle data, uh, the rest of your logic from your algorithm should be scheduled using schedule function. So go ahead and try it out. 